The moon's orbit has a point farthest from Earth called apogee, and another point closest to Earth called perigee. A supermoon occurs when the full phase of the moon coincides with perigee. This can only happen four to six times in a single year, but November's supermoon is unusually rare because the full moon will be closer to Earth than it has been since 1948, which means it will be slightly bigger and brighter than the average supermoon. An event like this won't happen again until 2034. On November 14, 2016, at exactly 6.23 a.m. Eastern, the moon will be just 221,524 miles from Earth. That's 31,000 miles closer than when it was farthest from Earth in October. About two hours later, at 8.52 a.m. Eastern Time, the moon will be completely full. Viewers in the U.S. should look up on the night of November 13, or early the next morning. Supermoons are about 30% bigger and 14% brighter than full moons farther from Earth. But most of the time, it's hard to tell the difference if the moon is high in the night sky. So the best way to enjoy a supermoon is to spot it low on the horizon or near foreground objects that offer some perspective. 